She's just reading me the Bible, guys. Read. Stop. Read the few. Okay. You read Give the... thanks to the Lord for who He is. That's no, not what He says. That's he what is, it says. For He is good. His love endures forever. Amen. <laughs> Jeffrey, stop. Good. Do you do it? No, pray out loud. Jeffrey, go. Uh, Just... You're praying. I'm reading your prayers. Dear Heavenly Father. Are you scared? Yeah. I'm nervous. I just got, yeah, I'm nervous. Why? Man. Okay, dear Heavenly Father. Thank you. No, you shouldn't be serious. You I am, man. You, but you can't laugh and pray. I'm sorry. Yeah. Thank you for me, Shani, the baby, Justina, and everyone we came up today. Thank you for letting us all get through our day. And we're working hard. I just smashed the gym. Thank you for Shani. <laughs> Shush, man. Why are you doing that? I'm, what's up? Going quiet. <laughs> Going quiet. I'm coming home safely. Even though Justina was late for school, I'm happy she got to school safe. And Shani, thank you for Shani. Even though I had the big, biggest fight. <laughs> I'm joking. Amen. No, no, no. Yeah. Okay, when we read this Bible, please make us focus. I hope I don't laugh. I just want to stay focused. And when Shani reads, I'm going to take it and I'll listen. Okay. Amen. And have, and have understanding. Of all the words. Of all the words. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Okay, amen. Guys, when we talk about raincoats here, yeah, I've never really gone through it. Um, you see this brand? You see this brand? Yeah, Stutterheim. Stutterheim. Best raincoat brand on the planet. This, this is the It Jacket. Like, this one is the It Jacket. You all know the It Jacket. It's PVC rubber. Fully, fully, fully. Let me just show you quickly. I have it on. Let me just show you. It's literally, not, nothing is getting in it. It's made out of rubber. It's not, no... Oh yeah, it's waterproof, but it's not really waterproof. No, no, this is rubber. It's rubber, bro. Nothing, nothing. If you have this on, you're not getting wet. Only your hands is of the at the end. But apart from that, you're good. You're good. Nothing, nothing is going through this. This, the good. This is the it one. I don't really wear this one. I don't know why, because it's so bright, isn't it? If I was going out in the park where it was raining, then I would wear this. But it's really bright. I don't know if you can see in the video, but it's really bright, isn't it? But yeah, man, this was the first one I got and I fell in love with the brand. This is the It Jacket, the It Raincoat. Then I got this one. This one is a long, this one is long. This one goes all the way down to my ankles. And I'm not that short, I'm five, ten and a half or something. This one, again, start at home. This one is matte. This has got a matte finish. Same thing. I thought, oh, but it's warm. It's padded, it's warm. It's not going to be as waterproof. Let me show you. Same thing. It's completely waterproof, bro. Completely water. Look at that. Completely waterproof. Look at that. You don't get wet. When you have these on, you don't get wet. Only thing that will get wet is if you wet inside here. In. But apart from that, again, this is matte. So with matte, it's a bit different than that. Can you see how it looks wet? But it's not wet. It's still PVC rubber, isn't it? Highest level. I right, can't. This is my favorite one. This is start behind again. And this one is matte. This is a matte, but this is a lightweight raincoat. This is not. All right, so basically I got this one. This one is thin, can you see? Because this is thick. It's really thick, like it's heavy. When you hold that in your hand, you can feel it. When you hold this in your hand, you can feel it. This is a long as well. It goes all the way down there, it's long. This one is heavy. This is light. It's still as waterproof, but it's light. Let me show you. Look, it's just as waterproof, but it's light. And it's matte. This one is really nice. Like this, this matte finish on this one is so nice. Difference is with this one, yeah, you can wear this one every day. You don't need to like only wear it when it's doing crazy raining because it's so light. If you wear the other one, you get hot. This, you won't really get hot because it's matte. Like this one, but if it was doing torrential rain, then I wouldn't wear this. But if it was raining hard, but it wasn't like, actually, fam, you can wear this in any rain because it's double seamed, double wielded, whatever you want to call it. Nothing's getting through. Nothing is getting through. 
And another thing with this matte one is that on the day it ripped, the, mo the day I've ever got most wet, like I was drenched on my feet because obviously I didn't have waterproof shoes on. I had this on. I didn't have the other thick ones on. I had this. And I, my whole jumper underneath was dry. Nothing was wet. I zipped it up, pulled the hood tight, and I was good. Nothing was wet. I was completely dry. And this is thin. So you're good in this. You can wear this every day as well because it's light. It's not heavy. Do you get what I'm saying? But yeah. Ah, right, calm. Then you got this one. This one now. This is new. I got this one the other day. This. These are reflective. Everything on this is reflective. It's, a, it's called the biker jacket. It's fully thick like the yellow one. But the difference is, let me show you. There, can you see that? It's reflective. Everything on this is reflective. You're meant to ride this. I mean, wear this when you're riding. It basically lights up. The jacket literally lights up. Look at it. Fam, it's as waterproof. And because when you're riding, look at this. When you're riding, yes, normally the pop, the jacket will come up in it because obviously you're riding. So what you do is I just unzip this. Bang. It opens like a dress. And you're good. Good. This one, I haven't worn this in the rain yet. But I know once I have this one on, if I know if I'm riding and I open it, I'm I'm covered. I'm good. I just need to get the track to you and I'm good. Do you get what I'm saying? These raincoats, the best raincoats out here. You can't find a better jacket. This is Sweden. This is these are from Sweden. This is Stockholm. Stockholm. Uh, Stockholm rain jackets. Nothing's better than this. Guys, I haven't squatted in ages. Like, I'm talking like, I'm, I promise you, I'm talking like six months. Wait, yeah, I can't remember the last time I actually squatted. Like, fam, I haven't been training because I was injured. I couldn't do nothing. But yeah, man, I'm back squatting again. I, my back, my lower back feels really weak. If you're watching, you can see that when I'm going down, I'm going a bit like that because you're really meant to go down, up like this. Obviously, you can lean forward a little bit and go but I'm like there, down. But I want to end up going straight down, straight up. But my back is, I wouldn't say it's tight, I would say it's weak. Like I can't keep that position. It feels me if you need to do it like that. But yeah, I'm, this is 60. I'm gonna go up to 70, maybe 80, and do a few reps and sets and see. But cause it's the first time back, I'm not doing that stupid. But yeah, that's good. <sighs> Guys, I think this angle is really good because you can see how, like, weak my back is. If I look down, I'm literally folding. Like, obviously it's not this extreme, but it's like this, like that. But you want to be like, eh? You can lean forward a bit. Down, there. So here, 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 down, sitting in there. Bang, not stinking there, yeah. but we're gonna keep working. I'm gonna do oh no, six reps again. Oh. 
Legs are so tired. Like if you, the technique was off in that last one. The technique was off, man. I didn't really like it. I'm not gonna say oh, it was the worst ever, but it wasn't as good as it should have been. My back is just weak. I need to strengthen it back up, man. But yeah, let's go on to the next exercise. I'm not gonna say it's the end of the world because I haven't squared in ages. Do you get what I'm saying? But yeah, man, let's work. Guys, I don't know if you can see my head, but I'm tired. Like, this exercise, I haven't done it in ages. It literally kills your back, like, your lower back, your hamstrings, and your bum, especially when you hold it for, like, a split second. When you hold it, when you hold it, uh, like that, in that position, so the muscle tense, you can really feel it. But I need to do it. So it's always, I've got one more set of 12 reps and then we're gonna move on to some lunches or something. So oh, let's go. Guys, I'm trying to go down all the way for seven and then half rep for seven. So all the way down like this, all the way. And then after, I want to go only to here, up, up, up. Obviously, it's heavy, so I can't do it super fast. But you get what I'm trying to do. You're meant to do the third um, rep, which is down to halfway. 
but I'm too tired. So I might try to do five, five, five. No. Oh, we'll see. Let's go. Okay. Six, seven, okay. Guys, I'm boiling. I'm not gonna lie. I'm eating a meal deal for dinner. What meal deal should I eat? Guys, I'm gonna end the video here. I don't know if you can hear me because I don't have my mic on any. But fam, I'm tired. Like, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm tired. I'm riding in it right now. But yeah, man, guys, today was the first leg. Fam, I haven't been training in it, so I can't expect something crazy to happen straight away. But fam, I'm literally so tired that my legs, fam, leg days kill you more than anything else. Especially when you're trying to squat heavy. Obviously, I wasn't doing no insane, crazy, like one trillion kg weight or whatever. But the weight I was doing was still heavy for me. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, I haven't been squatting. You could tell my technique was weak. My back was going in, but I pushed through it. So I can't be too angry. I'm not angry anyway. The only thing I'm annoyed about is the process. Actually, no, I'm just chatting rubbish, man. But yeah, I feel like in, a, in the weeks to come, I'm going to feel much, much, much better. Much, much, much stronger. I'm gonna look leaner, feel leaner. I just can't run yet. That's what really gets me lean, but I can't run because of my ankle. Like I ran and I stripped in it on a ditch and my ankle twisted. Obviously I've been strengthening up today. I'd obviously I didn't put it in the video, but today I was doing exercises for it. It's feeling much stronger. I would say maybe like at this rate, a week or two weeks of consistent strengthening up and I should be fine. I should be good then the weight will really start dropping off. But yeah, man. Guys, make sure that comes subscribe. I'll see you next time. So as of right now, in a bit.